everyone and welcome back to the channel everyone. Today is Friday, January 16, 2015. I have picked three cards from the Llewellyn's Classic Tarot to give me a depiction of the energies that we can expect for this Friday. And I have an Angel Tarot card um, to give me an overall energy of this day. And I have a Mermaids and Dolphins card to get us messages from our spirit guides and angels for this day. So we're going to go ahead and get started guys. The first card that we have up from the Llewellyn's Classic Tarot is the Strength card in reverse so let's take a look at it upright first the strength card upright shows this woman who is really grasping the head of this lion she has the infinite symbol above her head showing that she has infinite strength you know forever the strength the strength that she has is long lasting and um if she's really grasping the head of this lion is she's not really um using physical strength to do so she's using emotional strength and discipline so it's telling you that with it in reverse is letting you know that things are getting easier to deal with you're not feeling like you have to apply yourself so much to um conquering um this this energy or or this energy that has um, been feeling like you had to um be disciplined and um you know, really just have that emotional strength is really letting you know that, you know, that energy is starting to fall away and things are getting a lot more easier to deal with. So this is a really good card. You're not having to apply yourself as much as you've been having to do recently. The next card that we have from the Llewellyn's Classic Tarot is the World in Reverse, another reversed card. The World in Reverse shows all of these. I think these are the um, astrological signs. I think this is Aquarius, which is the water bearer. And this is um, an eagle, which is like Scorpio. And this is the bull, which is Taurus. And this is the lion. We have another lion, which is Leo. So, and you can see the angel. She's walking um, through the um, the laurel reef. And the laurel reef is all about victory and achievement. So she's walking. It's like she's walking from um, one cycle of her life into another cycle of her life. That's what the world is about. It's about completion of the project. And, you know, also um, once you complete a project, you, uh, you start something new. So it's really her um, starting something new and going into another cycle. But this in reverse is letting us know that you know things we haven't got to that completion point yet it's telling you to keep um applying yourself even though things are getting easier but you're going to get to that completion point um very soon you're going to get to that oh wow <laughs> You're going to get to that point where you want to be. You're going to get to, you know, those delays and, um, you know, that stagnation is going to fall away. You know, the work is going to be completed soon. Things are going to get more clear. It's telling you that things are getting easier. Things are getting clearer to you. And you're getting to that finish line. You're getting to that point where you're about to transition into this victory to this says You're walking through this laurel reef. So it's telling you that you're going to accomplish your goals. You're not, you haven't got to that completion point yet, but you're getting, you're on your way. You're on the correct path to get to that completion point, it's saying. Next card up is another reverse card. So with three reverse cards, guys, is really letting us know that there's been a change in the energies recently on this day. So um, it's also talking about with this card in, let's take a look at it upright first. As you can see, this person is really in like a blue coat and there's, he's like tending um, this river and he's looking at these um, three cups that have been knocked over in front of him like he's really sad about it he's really focused on the cups that have been knocked over what he's lost and the water or this little river that's right here is it's a little troubled so your emotions have been a little troubled recently and you've been really focused on the things that you've lost and it's telling you that you have these two cups right here look how like they even looked um 
they even look like they have some custom design to them but it's really letting you know that you still have emotional things you still have things to be happy about you still have things that are in your life that are um, supportive to you and it's telling you to you know let go of um, these troubled waters that you've been having with this river it's telling you to pick up these two cups that you have and go all, go home go back to your castle you know go back to your daily routines and with this in reverse that's exactly what it's telling you it's telling you to pick up your cups and move forward with your life go on with um your um your daily your daily tasks that you have in your day. Stop looking at the things that you have lost. It's telling you that you need to, even though things are getting easier, you haven't got to that completion point yet. You haven't um, had that accomplishment yet. You haven't had that complete victory that you're looking for. It's telling you that you can have this victory now that you're paying attention more to the things that you that are able that you're able to bring into your life. So it's telling you to pay attention to the things that you have right now and try to bring more things into to your life or continue working on, on getting yourself to this completion period, getting yourself to um, your, your new cycle of life. And it's telling you that you have so many other things that you can um, build now that you're um, starting a new transition. You know, it's telling you that things have gotten a lot easier. I know this week hasn't been a really easy week to deal with for anyone, but it's really letting you know that things are going to start getting easier now and to keep Keep applying yourself because you're going to have that accomplishment. You're going to have that completion. You're going to get to this finish line of accomplishment. And it's telling you to just keep, um, just take what you have. Don't look at what you've lost. You know, let what you've lost go. Um, steady. Well, you've already steadied your emotions, so that's good. But it's really telling you to just, you know, pick up the cups and go back to your daily routine. And, you know, just keep working and um, know that you're going to get to that accomplishment accomplishment soon. Next card up is the Two of Water, and it says a relationship that continues to grow closer. Forgiveness and the positive resolution of a conflict. Okay, so this is really good because in the weekly reading, I talked about the end of a difficult situation. The Two of Water is all about you coming together with other people or you coming together with another person. Now, regardless of what it is, it's you coming together with other people. So this could you be coming together with a family member, you coming together with a, um, a, a mate, whoever, it doesn't really matter, but it's, um, it's a, um, it's a shared belief. As you can see, these two people are really, um, on this, I think this is a whale, <laughs> or a shark or something, but they're riding the sharks together, and it's telling, it's letting you know that they have shared beliefs, shared interests, it's letting you know the relationship that continues to grow closer, it's telling you maybe you're in a relationship with someone, and it doesn't have to be just like a boyfriend, girlfriend, wife, husband relationship, this can be family members, this, you know, we have relationships with every different person in our lives, so it's telling you that the relationships that you have are growing closer, it's telling you that you're being, um, you're being put together with another person who's really um, going to be able to help you in this situation or help you nurture your emotions in this situation. It's talking about forgiveness. It's telling you to let go of any hurts that you've had and forgive people. Forgive um, come if you're coming together with another person because you've had some um, issues with this other person. It's telling you this is the day that you need to forgive this person. Have compassion. And it's telling you the positive resolution to a conversation so it's telling you today overall this day is really a day where a lot of um a lot of um, difficult situations are going to come to a culmination point. You know, uh, resolutions to conflicts that you've been dealing with is coming to a completion point. And it's really telling you that other people are in your life, that um, it, these could be um, conflicts with other people in your life, basically. And the spirit message that we have is, oh my gosh, I had the, I pulled the same exact card in yesterday's reading, guys. So this means that this energy is really, really intense at the moment. And I promise you, I shuffle the cards like 
a few times and I always ask for my spirit guides to guide me to the correct card for the spirit for all of these cards actually so this is a definite card that wants to come through and it says yes it says your intuition is correct take action accordingly this is telling you that you have the right ideas at the present moment the things that you've been thinking about um, are correct it's telling you that things are getting easier for you to deal with you're having that discipline and you're able to move forward with the things that have been um, kind of you know, feeling like um, a little bit scary, you know, feeling like you had to really apply yourself to a situation because it was a little out of hand. It was a little scary, but it's telling you those things are getting easier now. It's telling you that you're moving into another cycle, another cycle that is fixed and it, it, that is going to be a complete structure. We have four fixed signs of the astrology um, in astrology. And this is a person who's going um, through a laurel reef, which means accomplishment. So it's letting you know that that this is a fixed accomplishment in your life that you're working on and um, things are becoming more clear and continue to do the, more, the work It's telling you also that to be appreciative of the things that you have in your life right now and to pick up the two remaining th cups that you have pick up the remaining things that you have pick up your life the remaining things that you have in your life stop looking at the things that you've lost pick up the remaining things of your life and um you know stabilize your emotions as I think you have already and move on to your permanent structure it's telling you to nurture those relationships that you have with other people if you're having conflicts with other people if you're having type of incidents with other people it's telling you to forgive that person have compassion for that person it's telling you to um, resolve conflict and conflicts period it's telling you to come together with other people because these other people can help nurture you in this whatever particular situation you're having whether this be your family members whether this be your boyfriend your girlfriend whoever it is you know it's telling you to come together with other people join together. It's telling you that the um, the thoughts that you're having, the intuition, the things, the plans that you have, the road that you're on, the goals that you're trying to accomplish is correct. And it's telling you to take action on those goals and move forward because um, you're on the right track and you're going to be able to create so much more. It's, don't pay attention to um, the things that you've lost because you're going to be able to create the things that you have lost and extra things you know so because you're moving to another a new cycle that is um of comp of accomplishment so um and things are getting easier to deal with so um really enjoy this day really enjoy this friday just know you know keep doing the work you're almost at this completion stage i know i've been saying that a long uh, for a couple of days now but it's the truth you, you know you have to keep doing the work and you're going to definitely get to that completion point and things are going to get a lot easier to deal with so keep working all right guys these are the messages that i have for friday thank you for watching and i'll be back with you this weekend Bye bye